This is the field extraction solvent and the container to which you will transfer your coated filter when you are done sampling. The glass vial contains 3 milliliters of a 90% acetonitrile and 10% dimethyl sulfoxide solution. Be careful not to spill any of the solvent because this will affect your sampling results. Wear nitrile gloves when handling the coated filters and the extraction solvent. Nitrile gloves have excellent resistance to dimethyl sulfoxide but only fair resistance to acetonitrile. So if you do accidentally spill solvent on them, remove and replace the gloves immediately. Also, be aware both these solvents are toxic and flammable so you should familiarize yourself with the MSDS for the mixture. As soon as possible after sampling and in a clean location, prepare the sample for field extraction. Field extraction will be of benefit only if it is performed immediately after sampling. Carmen will demonstrate the field extraction procedure. Put on a new pair of nitrile gloves every time this procedure is performed. Clean the metal forceps each time you use them with isopropyl alcohol. Remove the coated filter from the cassette using the metal forceps. Gently roll the coated filter to form a cylinder that will fit into the vial. Remove the cap from the vial containing the extraction solvent. Be careful not to spill any solvent. Place the filter into the vial with the solvent so that it is flat against the inside surface of the vial. Avoid folding or crumpling the filter. Tightly seal the vial with the septum cap and vigorously shake the vial. Properly identify and label the sample. Wrap each file end-to-end -end with a completed and properly filled out OSHA Form 21. At this point you can also discard the backup pad and cassette. Perform the extraction procedure separately for each sample. Wear a new pair of gloves for each sample. Your field blank will be treated the same way. Extract a blank sample the same way as the air samples and submit it with your samples. Use the six-pack cooler and blue ice-type cold packs to transport the extracted samples back to your office in your vehicle. 